this is Joyce. She's gonna be working here now. I'm sure you can show her the ropes. Uh, if you need anything, I'll be out back. And something is stuck up his butt. Shh, he might hear you. What? What do you care? Are you sleeping with him? Have you ever worked at a cafe before? No. How did you get the job? I lied. My parents told me I needed to start paying for things, so I figured I could get any job to get them off my back. Oh. Uh, you're not going to be one of those girls that narc on me, are you? Uh, no. You totally are. God. Sorry. Uh, don't apologize. I hate that. So, so, uh, um, okay. Uh, you know, you shouldn't hate things. That's how wars start. So, uh, what do you do besides this? Well, I, I go to school at U of T for creative writing. Oh, me too. Oh, what do you write? What, what? You go to school for creative writing? No, I go to U of T. Oh. I think you're in my woman's class thing. Woman's studies? Whatever. So here's the fridge. Uh, it's where we keep all the cold food. Oh, well that's good. We uh, wouldn't want the food to be not cold. Um, and this here is the cash. Oh wait, I got this one. Let me guess. Um, that's where we put the coffee. Um, are you making fun of me? Well, I mean, you're kind of just pointing out the obvious. Here, just watch me. You're going to regular Hi. coffee black? Okay. Here's your change. Um, oh, here's your... Uh, just, Sorry, one second. Um, when it's black, you have to fill it up and then put a lid on it. Why? Of course, leave it up to a woman to screw everything up. Excuse, Excuse me? me? You think that only a woman can mess up on her first day of work? Oh, I'm sorry. Was your mother not a woman? Were you born of horse? Because every man is Superman and can't mess up at all. Oh, sorry. When you meant women mess up everything, it must have been when you were born. I bet you order black coffee because you have little man syndrome. Mm, Brienne of Tarth would mess you up. You guys are insane. Oh yeah? Come back here so I can take your balls out through your eye sockets. Yeah. What? Hmm. What? I think we'll get along just fine. An hour or two, curl my hair, put makeup on my face. Find something to wear to match my iPhone case. Lots of grace and poise with lattes in our hands. Crying over boys, fighting with our friends. We're girls, we're squirrels, we're girls. Took a Prager's test today because I'm feeling fat. Watch out. He's probably cheating on me So take me to the mall I need some female therapy We're girls, we're squirrels, we're girls We're girls, we're squirrels, we're girls No, 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 you have to, you have to follow me no, 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 grab the shell. Oh, God damn it. What? You told me to hit the yellow switch thing, so we did. Now you want to kill an innocent mushroom? It's not a person, Joyce. It doesn't have feelings. Yeah, it has a face. I don't understand why you even want to play with me then. It'd be easier if you just watched. I like having the red flower power. It's like I'm a dude with genital herpes. Pew, pew, pew. You're useless. Look who's finally home. Good, we can finally have some fun around here. <laughs> Hey. You're happy. Where have you been? Oh, heaven. <laughs> we have a ghost in the house. Are you gonna help me or not? I hate this, okay? I quit. So, who's the new guy this time? The pizza guy? No, she can't handle that much meat. The male guy? If uh, she got home and he delivered his package. Or, or, or maybe it's the assistant from her work. You know, I fired that other guy for, what, using the photocopier for unnecessary photocopying? Okay, okay guys, shut up, okay? No matter what you say, you can't ruin my mood. 
So you're not gonna tell us? You don't know him anyway. Yeah, because that makes a difference. So you got a big day? Oh my god, Joyce, why do you have to put it like that? Well, does he? Why? Why is that all you ever think about? It's been a week since she's got any. What do you expect she's thinking about? I don't know, normal things? Like what she's gonna wear tomorrow, or maybe what she's gonna make for dinner tonight? Mm. Mm -hmm. Like lingerie, or melted chocolate, dripped on a six pack. You're disgusting. Hey, I'm only human. You have a romance queen who thinks that's not what guys think about all the time. Newsflash, they do. So why can't I without anybody thinking it's weird? Is it so wrong that I just want someone to love me and take care of me? Yes. All I want to know is have you slept with them yet? Okay. Joyce, I'm I'm not a a slut. Okay? We we made love. Gross. Well, whatever you did, good for you for doing it on the first date. No, 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 he's the one. Oh, you don't have to defend yourself to me. It's Octavia Butler over there. I can't believe you, Caroline. How many times have I told you, don't give it away that easily? And you wonder why guys take advantage of you. You set off the Virgin Mary. Oh, shut up, Joyce, just because you give it away like a 24-hour drive through Yeah, and who doesn't want a Big Mac at 3 in the morning? Oh my, okay, guys, we're talking about me here, so. Yes. I hate men. What else is new? So, um, it's Patrick from the diner. Joyce, can I get a cappuccino? Yeah, coming right up. Oh, and uh, can you make the foam with skim milk? Um, it's a skim milk. Are you kidding me? I just steamed the milk. Foam. It's like two extra calories. Yeah, it's the worst. So, me and Camille were like, what's it to you if we have boyfriends? And he's all like, I hope they're not the jealous type. And then he just starts making out with the both of us. <laughs> How do you allow that to happen? What? It was fun. And besides, when's another opportunity like that going to arise? He's Daniel Radcliffe. He doesn't even live in North America. Do you even know who Daniel Radcliffe is? Yeah. He did some sort of television series or something. I can't believe you've never seen Harry Potter. Uh, we weren't allowed to read the books as kids. My mom and her husband are like super Catholic, so no witchcraft and stuff. Okay, so if you've never seen Harry Potter, how do you know it was Danny Radcliffe? Well, he told us he was. Girls, look, a customer. I mean, he's British, right? That doesn't classify anyone to be Danny Radcliffe. Well, he could have been. Oh, hello. Hi, I'm Daniel Radcliffe. Let's have sex. Girls! <laughs> You're really good at that. Nice. <laughs> Excuse me, can I just get a, a coffee or... Hello. Hi, I'm British. No, no, more like at the back of your throat. That's what he said. Oh my god. When a customer comes to the desk, you give them a hand. Why else do I pay you $11 an hour? What's his beef? Uh, maybe it's the fact that he's not getting any beef. <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe we haven't talked about this yet. So, Caroline dating Patrick? I am so mad at her. What? Why? Well, we both know Patrick's a dick. Especially to women. I mean, he's told us all those stories. Now we can't even go to that restaurant without being afraid our food's gonna get spat in. I don't think Patrick would spit in our food. Sylvia would. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> when Patrick breaks up with Caroline, She's definitely not going to want to go there, which sucks because they have really good chicken salad sandwiches. So then we're gonna have to find another cheap place to go. And then it's gonna take us like a month for them to figure out that we're regulars and give us free cake and stuff. So wait, are you saying that their relationship is destined to fail? That Caroline is not the girl that Patrick's gonna realize he needs to change his ways for? That guy has grabbed my ass more times than I'd like to admit. So? So if we go there while they're still dating, he's still gonna have to meet a quota of brushing my ass at least five times before I leave. Well, I say we don't judge until we see it for ourselves. I'm confused. I thought you would be more angry than I was. Oh, I'm almost 100% sure it's not gonna work out. But then I'd have to say I told you so and you know how much that pains me. Wait a minute. No, I 
I love that. <laughs> yeah, they're doomed. Oh my god! What are you doing? You almost gave me a heart attack. Got a big date tonight? No bigger than any other regular date. I'm just going to the movies, so. Gonna give him a blow in the back row. Okay, Joyce? <laughs> Ugh, okay. Come on, Maria isn't here. Let's have a girl talk. Okay. I wasn't gonna go any further than to just cop a feel over his jeans, okay? You know, like a, a soft love brush. And if he wants more? Pat is a gentleman. He wouldn't make me do anything I don't want to do. Okay? Hmm. So, so these handcuffs in your purse, you're just borrowing them for police training. Okay. <laughs> Why are you going through my stuff? Hmm? I'm the mama of the group, okay? I need to make sure that you have a fresh set of condoms in case he forgets his and that there's a breath mint in case you have garlic or something. <sighs> okay, yeah. Why am I friends with you? Uh, well, duh. <laughs> so what movie are you gonna see? A classic love story, Gone with the Wind. Sounds lame. So when's he coming to pick you up? He's coming around 5. We're going to grab a bite to eat. The movie's at 7.10. What's he gonna eat? Okay, what's with all the questions? I'm your best friend. Your roommate. I just want to know what's going on in your life. Uh-huh. Mm. Um, and how are things going with that guy you were seeing? What's his name? Um... Craig, was it? Yeah, so I, uh, I actually have work to do. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. You're gonna practice brewing coffee or anything? Shut up. Have a good date. Uh, yeah, I will. Hey. Hey. So I got the scoop. The what? The deets. What are you talking about? I can't go uno uno. Are you on crack? For Carolyn's date. We're gonna go crash, remember? Actually, I don't. Okay, well, they're gonna go see Gone with the Wind. Okay, well, if that's not a movie about passing gas, I'm not coming. You've never seen Gone with the Wind? I've always depended on the kindness of strangers. Well, that's a dumb thing to depend on. No, it's from the... Uh, never mind. Well, that sounds lame. Well, I'll buy you popcorn. All right, I'm in. Yes. Where and when? It's at 7.10 at the movie theater. We live in Toronto. There's more than one theater. Shoot. Oh, movie times, right? You can't have the same movie times for every movie theater. <laughs> oh, seriously? Your cover photo is a picture of your cat. What? I love my cat. At least you're capable of loving something. Hey. <laughs> uh, here we go. Oh, there's two showings of Gone with the Wind. Uh, one at Young and Egg, and one at Rainbow. So we'll go to both. We'll find them. One second. It's at the Rainbow. How did you- I asked her. Did we really have to get here 40 minutes early? Yes. Okay, but did we have to hide and lie down on the floor? Yes. <sighs> why are we going through all this trouble again? Shh. I still don't understand why we're even here. It's not like we can do anything. Yeah, but we can watch. You said that we should watch to see if they're a good couple or not. I also thought I said I was 100% sure that they wouldn't be. Yeah, well, I think you're being proven wrong. Ugh, wow. I always thought that would happen. What, Patrick being a good guy? No, no, me being wrong. You really think highly of yourself, don't you? Well, someone has to. <laughs> That's so... Ugh, disgusting. <sighs> no. It's making me want to barf. Sweet. But, you know, not as sweet as two naked bodies rubbing together. Naked. <laughs> you know. Huh. I wonder if that's what she thinks about when she's home alone in her room under the covers. Not me. <laughs> I think about my favorite TV shows, or cleaning my room, but not actually doing it. Oh, and this is messed up. Sometimes I think about if I had, like, a brother, if, like, I wouldn't have hated men so much. Or worse, I had a thing for him. Complete end sense. That'd be so okay. good. Just shut up and watch the movie. I think it's about to start. How long is this thing going to be? I think it's just over three hours. This is definitely not going to be enough popcorn.
actually. Um, could you just give me a sec? I just have to do something. Did you enjoy the movie? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, uh, hey Caroline! I didn't know you'd be here, weird. <laughs> Drop it. You really think I didn't know you were planning something when you came into my room and you said, so if I were to see a classic romantic movie, say, Gone with the Wind, for a date with a guy who's like a waiter or something, where would you suggest we go? Smooth. I'd have a mind to tell you the wrong place, but then you'd think something was up. I mean, I'm still just blown away we're in the same theater right now. So did you see what you wanted to? Yes. You seem really great together. Well, I'm really happy with him. Anyways, um, I better go before he thinks I broke my leg on the stairs or something. See you later tonight? Tomorrow. Ah, my little girl is all grown up. I hope you enjoyed the movie. I know I did. You're such an idiot. No, it's sweet. She doesn't know. She really knows. She does know. <laughs> Do you ever wonder why there's like so many people in the world who don't know who I am? What? Well, just think. Like, there's that lady who comes into the coffee shop and she orders the large hot chocolate with extra whip. You know, for example. And and she doesn't know who I am. Well, not really. And she's got a whole family and a ton of friends, and they all have a ton of friends and a whole family. That's gotta be at least 400 people, and they don't know who I am. Like, I'm amazing, how could that be? And I could use the same example for every person I walk by on the street. Like, they just walk by me like I'm another normal, dumb human being. It makes me feel like I'm just a tiny molecule that Went missing wouldn't be noticed by the billions of people on Earth. I would know. Yeah, well, who are you? Oh. Oh, what the? I hate men! <laughs> this all that I can dig in is the size of the Grand Canyon. The dog that held Although my heart belongs 